have discovered there are two basic kinds of people that come to God. There are relationship-oriented people and task-oriented people. And they're created like that. A, a, a relationship-oriented person, they, they come to God seeking a relationship with God. And as a result of their relationship with God, they get involved with what God's doing. But then the task-oriented person comes to God because there's a cause. They come to God because there's a need. They come to God because there's a need for themselves. There's a need for others. They want to see something done. But then in trying to do that and see that accomplished, they come to the place of realizing, I can't accomplish this myself, so I need somebody else. And then because I've got, I want to see this accomplished and I believe this is right and truth and real, but I can't do this myself, so therefore I I've got to build a relationship with God because he's got to do this through me because I want to see this done and God wants to see this done, but it's not going to be done without a relationship. I know some people, their relationship with God has produced a ministry. I know other people, including me, that their ministry is what produced a relationship with God. And, and my observations, because... Because I, I'm a student of people. I, 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 I want to understand people. I want to understand what makes them click. I want to understand how to help them and whatever because I'm a student of myself. And I'm, I'm wanting to, to be what God wants me to be. And I want to understand what my hindrances are and all of that. Because, because I'm a student of people, I, I, I've, I've, I've come to the understanding that you can't take a relationship-oriented person and make tasks their priority. You can't take a task-oriented person and make relationships their priority. Because God uses those two different kinds of people to balance everything out, okay? And neither one is complete without the other. That's why we this is need why we're in the each body other. together. This is why no one person can do this. We are created so that no one of us can do this self-sufficiently and independently of another. And I need people that are different than me. I need them to compliment me because I, I am not created to, to, to be a standalone version uh, of the epitome of what Christ would have a, a, a Christian or a man of God to be.